Hydronic heating system heats a space by moving hot water through some sort of radiator, whether it be baseboard or radiant floor heating. An important factor when designing your hydronic system is its flow rate. But how do we determine this? Hi, I'm David Darling, Technical Service Advisor for Johnstone Supply at the Balsam Group. Today, we'll be going over the Universal Hydronic Formula. So here's the formula. It's GPM equals BTUH divided by delta T times 500. So let's go over what each of those means. GPM is gallons per minute, and that is how much hot water we need to move through our hydronic system to heat our space. BTUH, or BTUs per hour, is the calculated heat loss of the space you are conditioning. Delta T is the temperature difference of your hot water in the heating loop. When using baseboard heat, the delta T is typically 20 degrees, or when using radiant floor heating, the delta T is typically 10 degrees, but you want to make sure with the manufacturer before calculating your GPM. And finally, the 500 is a constant we use for the heat characteristics of a gallon of water. So let's plug some numbers into this formula. You've calculated the heat loss of the space to be 22,500 BTUs per hour. We're running baseboard heat, so that's a delta T of 20. How much water do we actually need to move? When we plug in our load and our delta T, the formula becomes 22,500 divided by 20 times 500, which equals 2.25 gallons per minute. We need to move two and a quarter gallons through this loop every minute. So now that we have gallons per minute, we can effectively and efficiently set up our circulator pumps or choose the right circulator pump for our system. So there you have it. Calculating your GPM is one of the most important parts of designing your hydronic heating system, both for efficiency and for heating. Luckily for us, we have the universal hydronic formula to make it easy. Johnstone Supply, the Balsam Group, is your partner in HVACR. If you have any more tools or techniques you'd like to see, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.